So I have a question because you are that one of the first things I actually noticed about you just I don't know when it was uh, sometime last year I saw you pop up in my feed I was like oh who's this and then I was watching you is you 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 do operate in the prophetic and how how long has that been something that you've always noticed was there since like since you gave your life to the Lord and when you were younger because I know you'd mentioned that you were an atheist at one point mm -hmm. what was that process like yeah by the grace of God you know I uh, you know, the, the word says that gifts come even without repentance. Mm -hmm. So I didn't realize, and I realize now I was operating in discernment of spirits when I was playing at the poker table. I was so drawn because I knew what they were holding. I even sometimes the Lord would even allow me to hear some of the things that they're even thinking. I'm not even kidding. When I read wow. it in the Bible that Jesus would hear people's thoughts, I thought, what? Like, that's cool. <laughs> like, I, I understand. And so, you know, I, I um, was basically backslidden because I didn't believe in the Lord at the time. But, mm -hmm. you know, gifts come without repentance. So it's discerning spirits, hearing, you know, um, just discerning situations. And then when I got saved in uh, March of 2016, the next day I was on a flight going to my sister's house and the Lord, that's when I started hearing the Lord. Very clear, had messages for people. It was like a download of information. Your brother is ready to hear about me. Tell him about me. Message for my sister, message for my mom. When I landed, I told them what I heard. And they said, how did you know that? You know, how did you, like, I said, well, I don't, I heard it. So I realized then that the Lord speaks. I didn't realize I was prophetic. I just thought, okay, the Lord speaks to everyone. I mean, mm -hmm. he's God. He can talk to his children and we hear him. And, um, but I'm telling you, when I really started digging in the word, because the Lord had me in a cave. So as soon as I was out of poker, he had me at home in a cave with him. I call it a cave with him for mm -hmm. almost a year and a half, reading the word, studying the word. Um, he would show me different sermons and had visions and dreams. And it was, it was an amazing time with the Lord. And um, so that's when I realized, okay, I, I, I definitely prophetic. This is what it is. And he would, he would show things that had everything that he told me came to pass. Everything wow. I heard on March, 2016, you and your boyfriend are going to, are going to break up in June. Your brother, you know, is he's doing this and this, and every single thing came to pass. And I said, mm. okay, amen. So he speaks to us. He wants to talk to everyone. Listen, in the book of, um, in first Corinthians, it says that we all may prophesy. That's what Paul mm. said. We all may prophesy. And in, in chapter 14, you, we all want to, we all, you should, you should yearn for the gifts of the spirit especially prophecy to encourage one another. Mm -hmm. So we all can prophesy. Yeah.